Alright, in this video I'm going to show you how to make wizard wands from straws. So you start out with a fourth a cup of water and a fourth a cup of flour and you mix that together and then you cut up newspapers and strips and you just wrap it around straws kind of twist it around like a spiral then you let it dry for about eight hours. I left it overnight in my garage to dry. And I tried to copy the Harry Potter wands that I saw on the movies and also just googling the images. So I did one Harry Potter wand that's just a straight wand with the grip and then a Bellatrix wand which is kind of bent like a witch's finger and then a other's wand. So I use this clay and I wrapped around and made the knobs about five or six of them and I used a toothpick and I poked the holes and made the designs of like a bone so holes in the middle and then on the sides the lines on each notch then I let that dry for or five hours Then with using acrylic paint, I first did the first coat. With the elder one, I did a light gray. Bellatrix and the Harry Potter one, I did just a light brown. And then I let that dry for a couple minutes, about 20 minutes, and then it's dry. And then I did the added detail. I added white to the elder one, so it looked more like bone texture and then I added another second layer of brown because I could still see the newspaper. Then with a little bit of water and a little bit of black I brushed on the black paint just to add a, a kind of dark shade color to the details. Once I let that dry I added a clear coat of spray to add strength so the paint wouldn't chip. And that's how I made the Elder Wand and the Bellatrix and Harry Potter Wand. It's pretty inexpensive to build. Hope you enjoyed watching. <laughs> Have a super day.